Welcome back to the New Music Alliance Radio Hour. I'm Ace House Thor, joined this week by Mistress Miriam and Mark Ramone. You just heard The Letter by Linda Perry. Uh, before that, Manic Pixie Dream Girl by Banshees. And starting things off, Alicia Witt with New Word. Very gloomy block there. Very, very emotionally evocative. I, I know. I'm sorry to drag us into the gloomy place, but we're artistic people. We have to... You have to sit in our gloom every once in a while. The world is not smiling happy all the time. Absolutely. On a positive note, Linda Perry has new music. Yeah. This is brand new. Released as a single in March. Yeah. Um, So it's, wow, it's quite something. It, the, the vibes are beautiful. Obviously we all know Linda Perry does incredible work and this, this lives up to it. This lives up to everything she's done before. I, I, I don't know. The harmonies, too. Oof. The harmonies. I almost, it's kind of interesting to me. You know, Linda Perry, it, she's a huge you know, star um, in terms of uh, songwriters. She's in the Songwriters Hall of Fame. She's written for uh, Christina Aguilera and for Pink. Um, right. A true know, I mean, legend. Great. I mean, she's a legend, you know, for non blondes, also her, her own band. Right. And this song, I kind of want to call Linda and say, <laughs> This song, right? Like, w- why did you release this now? Like, the sing- like I'm so interested in it. There's a lot here to dig into lyrically. And I, I suppose that's a bit of a theme with the whole set. There's a resonance here. And she's bu- from Springfield. And then before um, that, before that, we had Band She's. Great band name, obviously. Uh, yeah. Definitely. I've kept an eye on them for a minute. Uh, they're out of Hartford, Connecticut. And the stuff they do is really exciting it's quite energetic a lot of the time but this is a very stripped down uh track of theirs that uh, the lyrics i thought it was a cool song of empowerment the way i was reading it It it's kind of the the person singing is kind of carefree but don't let that you know think you can walk all over her she's you know she's empowered it's complicated it's a complicated song there's a lot there's a lot going on in it sort of a deconstructing the trope of the manic pixie dream girl which there's a lot in that that's exactly what i was about to say yeah i, I don't know I, <laughs> it's a song i've been trying to writing write for years and years and years because i've always wanted to <laughs> collaborate <but> with them <laughs> i would love to <laughs> um, yeah no nah, they do really good stuff and this is this matches everything they do and we started with alicia witt new word and and many of you might know alicia's acting career she was discovered as a child by david lynch she Mm -hmm. was in the original dune um, and the original twin peaks the original twin peaks she mark what is the show that you and and she was on the show that's incredible at the age of five reciting romeo and juliet and then even more recently she was on shows like orange is the new black she's got a pretty incredible acting career uh, she's from worcester massachusetts worcester. and her music is also quite incredible she's worked with ben folds she's released some really fun albums and this the piano work on it really excellent it is a beautiful she's a magnificent pianist um mm-hmm. apparently a child prodigy i mean she's she's a fantastic musician beautiful voice I mean, she has she has it all going on. I love the sound of this song. And yes, it does lyrically go along with where this block is at. And uh, I think I made a point of doing that. Are we going to turn it around in the next block? Are we going to lighten things I, up? Oh, we're we're taking it to the party in the next block. Yeah, let's Ooh, do it. What have we got? <laughs> we are starting this off with the magic markers bonfire. 